from one amazing SSB BM figure to a better one. Wait, that implies? Yes, Jet Shadow. But why, you might ask? Well, it's a summary of problems. The first one is size. She really needed to be bigger. Then there's backpack, like... What the fuck? Couldn't they design it so the cockpit sits flush with her back? Someone limited articulation, and yes, I know she has an app crunch and chest too, but one needs the backpack to be unplugged, and the second just thoops into place. Same deal with the butterfly joints. I mean, you can still use them, but they aren't intentional. The head doesn't even have full rotational range. Like a wrist source and ankle pivots is truly abysmal, but at least she has an upward feed movement, I guess. Her bulge in the hips make putting her in an ace stance a challenge, to say the fucking least. The weight of her backpack forces her to lean back, and her legs tend to collide one with another, which doesn't help. Like, the only positive I can give this figure is that it's more screen accurate than car shutter, which was going for the uncompleted look. When this goes for the complete look and it adds a fake car chest when there is no car mode to begin with. I guess the other only positive would be the jet mode. And the transformation to achieve it is kinda awful. You know me, I don't care about transformations, but this one I just really fucking hate and I really don't like transforming her. But I must say, if those were the sacrifices they had to make to achieve this jet mode, they did a great job. It's not perfect, but there is no robot under it. It even has articulation as in the thrusters can move and this panel opens. It really does feel like they put all their effort into the jet mode and none into robot mode and I just can't forgive it. And the tier list score is C. It would have been AD, but the jet mode carries it.